Hello everyone, good morning, happy new week in couponing, and welcome to your stop and watch CVS video for today, or for this week rather, of July 9th through the 15th. So glad that you are here, hope that you're having a wonderful day. Let's dive into some updates. So I did post an unadvertised deals video. Check that out if you have a chance. There are some new deals, hair care, hand soap, a really awesome body wash deal. And actually I have some updates that I'll share regarding that particular deal. Thanks to you guys in just a sec. Really great deal. It ended up one and going from a uh, to a good deal. Um, what else do we have this week? What else did I post? There's some good digital coupons. We're going to talk about double digital coupons not the manufacturer but rather the like mystery offer coupons did you get any this week you might want to check your account because at first i really wasn't paying attention i get up super early on sunday and then i realized that i had a double of one that makes for an amazing money maker deal again that we will dive in in just a second so still having login issues. I noticed on my phone a lot that it brings up a prompt logged out, like timeout, logged out, whatever it says. And I've never seen that before. Um, so different things are going on with like the system. And if you use a desktop to enter in your orders on CVS.com, sometimes they're showing the extra bucks, sometimes they're not, especially when you know you're getting an extra buck. Um, sometimes you have to log out, refresh, do whatever you have to do, but feel confident that you're getting that extra buck before you do the deal. Summer 20 code is still a go this week or so far anyway. I don't know when they're going to take it away, but I will be posting an online deals video. And in that video, I'll kind of, I'll incorporate using that summer 20 and some scenarios that you can grab this week to save. Cause I think everyone could save at CVS. Walgreens is great this week. They kind of went from blah to not blah, but you know, so, so okay. Regular week to something much better. Um, I did my haul video. I did use my 80 or 80 off 20. I wish 20 off 80 coupon and it seemed to go really good. I did have one issue that I wanted to share with you guys. So the cover girl, I didn't get the insert coupons, but, um, we did get a $2 cover girl digital, um, and a printable coupon. So I printed the printable coupon. That coupon came off fine on the perfect blend pencils, but the $2 digital did not. So they issued me a $2 extra buck, which I have a really great store um, with different cashiers. Sometimes, you know, if I show that the coupon was clipped, they'll issue it to me um, and whatnot. And sometimes they don't, but I lucked out today. So I did get a $2 coupon um, extra buck for that particular coupon. So just watch your receipts, check before you leave the store. It's easy to fix it before you head home. So an unadvertised deal was on soft soap and Irish spring body wash. Now the soft soap deal got even better. So they're buy to get a $4 extra buck. Soft soap is a little bit cheaper at $6.59 in store where Irish spring is $6.99. But check your Ibotta account for $2 rebates on soft soap. I checked my rebates. Thanks to you guys for sharing. I know Amy shared and there were quite a few other comments that I kind of grasped really quick um, before I ran into CVS. So it was perfect timing. Um, I read my Ibotta rebate because I'm trying to be more diligent with that. It didn't say anything about using coupons or coupons not, you know, cannot be used combined with this deal. So if you buy two of them, you're going to get $4 cash back from Ibotta. So it actually, I know in the unadvertised deals video, I said you should get a soft soap and an Irish spring totally wrong. You should get two soft soap. It makes for a much better deal. So check your Ibotta before you do this deal. Rebates can vary per account. Now there's a huge moneymaker deal. I was so excited. Let me see if I can find it. Here it is. Um, I, I wasn't, okay. Let me talk about those double instant coupons. So I don't know about you guys, but I got two double coupons for $5 off of Revlon. Now CVS gave it to me. I was using it. Um, I don't see anything wrong. They were in my account. Let me know if you guys had two of them. And then I also had two off of the two OGX, which I may go back midweek and do a midweek haul. 
um, and use that those coupons because I think OGX has a promotion this week. So I'm going to look into that. I, I didn't run and do that deal today because nothing was tagged at my store and it's always, you know, it's hard enough <laughs> to find enough deals and enough products, but then to find the right ones that are included in the promotions when it's not tagged. It can be stressful so that's one downfall but my store may not even be tagged until like tomorrow or Tuesday so Revlon is a really awesome deal if you remember in my best deals video I had a 3 off 10 cosmetic CRT so since I was using my 20 off 80 I did this in a separate transaction the Revlon and this week it's spend 20 get a $5 extra buck um, I clicked on my coupons they did not extend because I probably would have saved them till next week. So if yours extend, stay tuned. I'm going to give you a sneak peek of deals starting the 16th, but mine did not. So I thought, let me do it this week. Plus, you don't know if the Ibotta rebates are going to disappear. There are tons of Revlon Ibotta rebates. So initially I clicked on the I rebates because I know that I can get two products for 20 bucks. There are I rebates that are a limit of five for $3 cash back, and they do not state cannot be combined with other coupons. Now, I don't know if that varies per account because, um, you know, I don't know if some accounts do say that and some don't uh, randomly on rebates if they're doing that, have no idea. So always just check your account and see. So I grabbed these two. They were like a little bit over 20 bucks, but um, well, let me grab my receipt actually. It's right here. Um, so the brow pencil was $9.99 and then the quad eyeshadow was $10.49. So we're at like $20.49 roughly, $20.48. I had two of those $5 Revlon cosmetic coupons, instant coupons, which that was a gift. Sent them both to card. I said, I'm doing the deal today. I don't want them to disappear. I don't want them to go away because the deals have been dry. CVS, you're going to give me two of them. I'm going to use two of them. And they both came off. And then I use a three off 10 cosmetics CRT. So that was a total of $13, which brought it down to like $7 and something cent. We'll just say seven. We'll just round it. And then I did earn a $5 extra buck. So here's the $5 extra buck. Plus I got a 20 off 80 for next week too. So we're at $7.00 get a $5 extra back. We're at $2 out of pocket for these redeemed to Ibotta for two $3 rebates. It's going to make them free at a $4 money maker. So really awesome deal. I did have a four off 25 Revlon CRT, but I just used my three off a of 10. It made for a much better deal. So I hope that you guys can grab a money maker. It would still be like a dollar money maker pre-tax. So even if you don't have the three off 10 cosmetic CRT, you're still go good to go, excuse me, for a great deal. So yes, 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 yes. Um, that was it. Just the CoverGirl coupon did not come off that I saw so far. I'm going to check my receipt, you know, with the magnifying glass when I get home. But other than that, I got some good deals. I got 15 items. I know they weren't free, but I know that they were super cheap. But I did get my CarePass membership. So technically in my eyes, because I only pay four or five dollars for care pass because I pay it yearly per month I get that bonus extra buck reward so technically it would be free for me but everybody doesn't have care pass so check back for my haul video definitely some good deals to go ahead and do now we're going to talk about a sneak peek of deals starting July 16th through the 22nd this is a sneak peek of a couple of deals just to kind of decide if deals are better to do this week or wait until deals starting the 16th now let me tell you one deal is um, the Revlon so Revlon, this current week is spend 20, get five, like I just mentioned. Next week, starting the 16th, it's going to be buy two, get a $5 extra buck. So you can actually get some cheaper products, you know, if you wanted to. Um, but again, my instant coupons did not extend, and I was just happy with the deal that I got with Revlon today. But um, let me tell you which ones did extend. OGX did extend to next week. L'Oreal did extend, Revlon did it, but Maybelline did. Those other instant coupons did extend, it was just the Revlon. So a little bit sneaky, 
but some of them are and some of them aren't. So when you get them on Sunday, if you're a Sunday couponer like me, you can always see if they'll extend to the next Sunday and then you can decide if you're gonna keep them or use them. But with the Ibotta rebates, honestly, I would do the Revlon deal this week. Um, another deal you wanna do this week is Elvive. It's better this week, on sale two for $9. My Elvive is up to, I think it was $5.59 when I went in store and showed you the pick. It used to be $5.29, so 30 cent increase. This week, it's buy two, get a $3 extra buck, and they're on sale two for $9. Next week, they're going to be full price, and they're going to be buy two, get a $4 extra buck. So they're a little bit of a better deal this week, and we have a digital coupon to use. But if you like Elvive, I know coupons.com has a printable coupon as well for Elvive. So if you wanted to do the deal next week, you can print one of those printable coupons, put it in an envelope, and hold it for next week's deals. What else do we have here? Oh, the Spend 30 got a $10 extra buck deal is back as well. And then CoverGirl. So next week we're getting a CoverGirl mystery offer. CoverGirl is going to be buy two, get a $4 extra buck or buy three three, get a $7 extra buck. So if you have extra CoverGirl coupons, you could go ahead and stock up on CoverGirl. I was pleasantly surprised at the selection of, you know, $4.99 products at my store. So i um, hopeful that um, if you have the coupons and your store has the products, take advantage of those deals. And like I said, we're getting a mystery offer coupon. So I don't know what it could be. Could be good. And who knows? It could double like the Revlon this week. And let me know if you guys got any that doubled. OGX and Revlon doubled for me in my account. So I had two of them, which for Revlon was amazing. So that, oh, and the Spend 30 get a $10 extra back deal. We'll be back with Pampers, Tide. Tampax, always, we're getting a three off two digital and more. So just a little sneak peek to get you guys ready. I hope this video was helpful. Um, again, check out the unadvertised deals video. Don't forget to do that Revlon deal. Um, CoverGirl's a great deal. It's a moneymaker deal if you have the insert coupons. If you have the digital coupons, it could possibly be free with those $4.99 products. And then there's just some really easy deals. It was easy couponing this week, not stressful. There's an unadvertised deal on paper products, but it was too high out of pocket for me, and I just don't have enough overage to cover that high out of pocket to make it a, even a good deal. So thank you so much for watching, guys. I will see you in my haul video. Take care and enjoy your day.